and that is the clear and stark choice in this election. Will we move New Hampshire forward as we have under Governor Lynch, bringing people together to get results? Or will New Hampshire go backward with the extreme and divisive agenda of Ovid LaMontagne and the Bill O'Brien legislature? <laughs> Don't boo, vote. Yes. Right? I will move New Hampshire forward with an innovation plan that will help our businesses grow so that our families can succeed. As governor, I will maintain and build on New Hampshire's competitive advantages to make New Hampshire the best place in America to do business. And let me be very clear, I will veto an income or a sales tax. Now, Ovid LaMontagne has said that he wants to be radically different, a radically different governor than John Lynch. And he seems intent on proving it with his extreme <laughs> policy positions. Ovid wants a constitutional amendment that would end the state's responsibility for local schools and wants to divert taxpayer money to private religious schools. <laughs> what am I going to say? Don't go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> He supports teaching creationism in our public schools. He has said that ensuring universal public kindergarten was a mistake. That if the legislature could make sure every child could go to kindergarten, my goodness, what would come next? <laughs> That's Ovid's radical difference. I'll tell you what will come next if you help elect me in November public money going to public schools. <laughs> tougher, tougher and better math and science standards. So New Hampshire is building the homegrown workforce our businesses need. That's the New Hampshire way. That's how we can move New Hampshire forward. This legislature cut funding for higher education in half, raising costs on our middle class families. Ovid has said that tuition costs are not his utmost concern. And that investing in an educated workforce is, and I'm quoting here, putting the cart before the horse. That's Ovid's radical difference. Well, tuition costs matters to me and to families across New Hampshire. That's why my innovation plan begins reinvesting in our public colleges and freezes tuition for the next two years. <laughs> That's the New Hampshire way. That's how we can move New Hampshire forward. This legislature has cut health care for thousands of New Hampshire citizens. It even tried to repeal a 12-year-old law requiring insurance coverage for birth control, which would have raised health care costs for women across New Hampshire. Now Ovid LaMontagne has a plan for the state to take over Medicare for our seniors. It's a plan that could increase health care costs for our seniors by thousands of dollars a year. That's Ovid's radical difference. Well, I've worked with Democrats and Republicans to end the ability of insurance companies to discriminate against sick workers and to pass a law that let, let young people stay on their parents' health insurance until age 26. fighting to make sure that our citizens have the health care they need at a price they and our businesses can afford. That starts with stopping any legislative takeover of Medicare. That's the New Hampshire way. That's the New Hampshire way and that's how we will move New Hampshire forward. Under Ovid LaMontagne's version of live free or die, abortion would be illegal even for the victims of rape or incest. And doctors and women would be treated as criminals. And the state 
would get to prevent loving couples from marrying. That's Ovid's radical difference. I believe live for your die means that workers should have the right to organize all loving couples. And that women should be able to make their own health care decisions. That's live free or die. That's what I will fight for. That's the New Hampshire way.